Hello and welcome back to Alien World. Today's topic is path analyzing on footprinting Python. All right, in this lab, uh, I want to look at the path analyzer pro. In order to install that, I would imagine you have to go Google and search for path analyzer pro. So I'm using the VMware and virtual machine. So let me take a full screen. Okay, so you have to go to uh, Chrome or whatever you have browser. Just search for Path Analyzer Pro. Okay, click on that. Okay, so here you go. This is the basic instruction that how you install and how to use the Path Analyzer Pro. So what we are looking for, we are looking for download we have to download this okay so there are some premier version of the path analyzer like if you have the mac OS or any other and the like red hat or any other linux uh, version you can basically download for that but i am using on windows so i will download for the windows so this is a more window path analyzer for window I mean, like, mean. Okay, so if you have like uh, any other OS, like Universal Mac OS, if you are running on this on um, Mac OS, or if you have Red Hat, Debian, or any other like any other uh, flavor of Linux or any other operating system, you can choose your like your fit. I have the Windows, so I'm gonna choose Windows. Okay, so I'm downloading this. Just click on save file so it will down so we are waiting for downloads let it to be downloading okay so it's downloaded now click on open the file just click on that run so it's preparing to install just hit next accept that I agree I agree the terms and conditions just set the default uh, default path or you can choose uh, where you want to install the path if this is just for me or if you want to uh, install this for everyone so just click on hit next you don't have to change anything on list so just click next and next and there you go so it's popping like next it's showing some warning let's see your windows firewall setting may block path analyzer pro props and tracing features to create a rule and allow path analyzer pro to operate properly we will do it later so that's completely and successfully has been installed okay so here we go we got installed everything okay so this is now pop up let me to a bigger screen you okay, now maximize your path analyzer pro as much as you can or whatever it fits so from the location you don't need necessarily to download and save it just run the wizards real quick and accept the license agreement you can install where you like that you will ever do it literally just be next 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 to user just like I do I did so okay you downloaded that and you installed it properly or if you have any doubt or you got any issue just comment the comment section i will solve it out okay so we will look all the option here put uh, basically for os i layer three sometime four or sometime i will look at and uh, let us go ahead and make that uh, be large so type the target because uh, we are looking whatever your target is so my target is uh, all in one market dot fc dot com all in one market dot fc dot com this is a my own target if you like uh, such any uh, else so you can choose any of the target whatever you want okay so this is the first i am gonna do like layer 3 osi model this is the icmp and uh, choose that 
and it's going to be run our report you see it working down here let me trace the report oh my god let's draw a socket i think uh, i'm missing something okay so let me just wait for a minute come back I'm sorry for the raw socket issue guys because if you install the uh, path analyzer pro you will also get the same issue so what you have to do is just go click on click on the icon and uh, to your troubleshoot compatibility because uh, it's uh, designed for XP version of Windows so I'm running Windows 7 so this is the issue okay so now it's uh, So we can run every just evaluate this and uh, let's try again our target all in one dot market dot mc dot com let's try first one or as a three model icmp test We will uh, look all these options like uh, layer 3 OSI model layer and a lot of people here get confused basically to we will look at all the option but typically we are in layer 3 sometime or 4 sometime or we will look at the and let us go ahead and there we go so we got no reply packet received after TTL you may try changing settings so actually I don't want to change the settings because we are not getting any replies so let's look at the sign phase one DNS record was found and the this address all in one is our target. So we found the the real IP address, forward DNS record, and the lot of uh, like uh, we are doing recognition and footprinting. So we got a lot of information about the uh, this website. And this is pretty much good. Uh, like uh, the routing address is the IP address is this 199.1. Uh, sorry, the 59.242.151, and this part of the network prefix is slash 24. It's uh, really good. This origin autonomous system is uh, this number, and the registry is like uh, we all good. Got the uh, some information of about this site. And let's use the chart. So make this better. Because uh, we didn't get any report from the IP address, because it's saying no reply packet was re received there, so we didn't get the chart over there. What's the geo? You can also like find the location of the uh, server is that using uh, the website that uh, our target, and uh, you get like country names and state provinces names, or even the roads where it's located. You can find by latitude or longitude by the simply just uh, select an option wherever you want but i like to go with default settings so there we got the logs um use device here so everything is fine this is our season log that we are connecting with our target so yeah that's uh, i see we did one test like icmp protocol we use ICMP as well we can use UDP and TCP and uh, some other sources of the program oh that's uh, really tired man okay, so let's look on the stats so this is our source and uh, this is our target IP address 199.159.242.151 ICMP and distance 1 so let me do one thing I just want to thing it uh, on this address uh, this is nothing but I just want to take a clear shot that it's alive or not so I'm just bringing in 9.4242.151 and let's see what we got back it found that person is successful It's saying like the requested timeout. Maybe we can try several times to ping that that we get uh, like 100% our packet was sent, and that's uh, okay. So it's 100% loss. So that's why our report is also.
Oh, and uh, that's why it's 100% lost, and that's why we got the no reply packet received for 50 TL. Uh, can we try something else? Like, uh, we can choose uh, another target. Like, uh, I want to choose my target as uh, Google. Google.com. Google.com. Well, let's see what we are going to get. Because it's Google and it's really protected, man. And I don't think so. So we didn't get anything here also, but I don't know why I'll think that Google. We got the IP address of Google.com. And let's try to ping whether it's because uh, maybe I'm wrong or my system is wrong. I don't know. So let me sort it out. 217.160.132 and it's pinging like correct with ping well 0% loss ping statistic and it's really good okay so look at the uh, where we got paid because we didn't get any Okay, okay, let's try with different I I'm in protocol and uh, I want to try again my old target all in one market market.com Unknown host all in one market Wow, it's, uh, oh sorry not all in one market, I forgot to write there fz.com all in one market dot fz dot oops, not a that's e okay why all in one market dot oops man I'm in too hurry it's bad okay yeah so uh, you can ICMP or TCP or UDP just take the one wherever you can possible Always start with ICMP first like uh, That specifically in this layer 3 of the OSI model I was referring to that you have larger 4 of the OSI model which is TCP connection oriented and UDP connection list you can choose your source port and the in this case random number anywhere through that would be fine uh, there are different tracing mods if you want to adapt if you want to start getting fancy you can actually say hello to host by saying goodbye you send it to finish request which is kind of over old flag tcp flag like uh, to, to send someone because it is like saying hey i am finished and then working working away so you can set the length of the package you can set the lifetime millisecond and type of services all you do this like uh, here like milliseconds whatever you want maximum TTL like I have set this default 30 or I can increase it and many other like uh, work ahead limit like uh, it's saying TTL 1 or you can set your uh, expand that to 5 to 10 or whatever and that's the point us so I don't want to go through that so minimum scatter millisecond and uh, props the TTL so minimum is 1 and maximum is 10 so I got the 1 because uh, uh, it's not replying anything so my maybe my host is not traceable or it's uh, I mean it's blocking my tracing so maybe you can find any other target which is uh, not blocked for tracing but yeah so these are parameters that you are likely to just uh, tweak a little bit uh, every now and again to see how the system and start putting those pictures together slowly slowly and slowly if you want to specify a particular sequence or number of just let it start one which is probably the easiest way to go and uh, this is realistic all we are to be looking for right now so we are going to go everywhere but let us one packet receipt after TTL you may change your setting you have go, got IP address uh, here like uh, setting and uh, whatever if you uh, say something like uh, uh, 
that we are in sign of physics. This is the TNS record that we find uh, on TNS record, like 119. Uh, let's again change 185.27.134.139. And uh, yeah, whatever it is, just uh, record that routing. We know it is an IP address again, layer 3, but it's also disclosed the subnet mask here and uh, oh, it's a this is a great hosting company uh, i always recommend a2 hosting if you have got any question about that you give me a call basically if i law enforcement and uh, need to get involved so as i clear that we can also see the charts but i will and uh, i don't know any other target cause uh, I don't want to ping anyone else because I don't have permission. So this is my own site. I am the owner of this site. That's why I'm tracing this one because no one can complain on me like they are tracing or pinging my site. So I'm just showing you guys demo. So just try different ports and different protocols uh, like uh, source port. Uh, it's given and uh, 53. Let's try different phrase random number we are going to try to get random number there is a uh, tracing mode default you can set uh, uh, things like adaptive or sensor packets only whatever you want okay okay there is a lot of things to do but uh, for now it's over and thank you for watching hope you guys liked and uh, learned something and if you got any issue you will comment below in the comment section and uh, please stay tuned and thank you for watching i'll see you in the next video thank you guys